hi guys now we are going to see interfacing Arduino you know with IR sensor buzzer LCD and then LED so whenever IR sensor detect obstacle we will get intimation from LED and then buzzer and LCD display so now we are seeing program MLC program this one is we compile and enter or you know ID software open source software so here as include liquid dot crystal so this one is 16 into 2 LC display header file so we are using those header file predefined functions by calling that object so here we are using that function name with LCD as here so this pins are LCD pins, 13 for register pin, 12 for enable pin, remaining 4 pins are used for to transmit data. So to print data to uh, like to display data in LCD display. So here IR sensor output pin was connected with the second pin of Arduino you know and then LED also connected with third pin of Arduino you know and then buzzer also connected fourth pin of Arduino. So those pins are digital pins from Arduino you know. So now initially we fix sensor, uh, your sensor output as low. So here LCD is uh, like a wide setup. So in Arduino most common function setup and then loop. Setup function we initialize LCD serial monitor and then pins. So pin mode like IR pin input. IR pin means it's a variable it hold as second pin. So whenever obstacle detected IR will get some value. So this value will be given into fed into or you know you know like so that uh, second pin has an input pin like we will give some information to or you know you know like sensor give information to or you know you know. So second pin was input. So whenever that input will be processed we will get output through LED pins, LED and then buzzer pins. So these pins are connected, these pins are defined as output pin, IR pin as input pin, serial pin. So we need to get output and then to need to watch in serial monitor means here serial monitor was there. So if I press you will get one tab so it will show the output. So now here throwing error because so now we are not connecting Arduino you know to our PC like here don't show that port port was hidden because we are not connecting and then wide loop so continuously we are monitoring sensor output so higher pin was connected with a, a digital pin of you know you know so we are using digital read so we read value from higher pin sensor output. if it is low means we will print no obstacle present in serial monitor and also LCD clear so LCD clear means if any oh, wordings are printed before that means it will clear that words that as like so LCD clear that display so print no obstacle was presented in front of your sensor this means after that LED was low buzzer pin was low so LED and then buzzer will not intimate if not low means IR pin output as uh, not low means so in some obstacle was present in front of IR sensor like not low means it will present some obstacle so high means obstacle was there in IR sensor and then LCD clear the previous output from the display it print warning obstacle was there with the cursor cursor means uh, like LCD having a two lines uh, 16 like first line second line so first line print 16 characters second line print 16 character totally we are fit print 32 characters so here obstacle there printed in second line so LC LED that time LED was high buzzer pin was high like when we like obstacle so delay it will take some time delay to reproduce the output from IR pin continuously monitoring will take some time delay so now we are going to see hardware so now we need to compile that one 
we compile means here it will show what are the predefined files are there so done compiling compile successfully we are not getting any errors so now we are going to see hardware so this one is Arduino Uno board so most common one so here you will see digital pins this side is digital pin this side is analog pin so we dump program to this port USB port connected with PC after that we using 16 into 2 LCD display so here 16 into 2 LCD display so back side I had a pin numbers so VSS VC P so we need to connect this board to what you know you know means only we easy to connect we dump that We connect LCD to what you know, you know board. So this one is potentiometer to adjust brightness of LCD. Next one is IR sensor. So IR sensor, this one is receiver, this one is transmitter. So in our obstacle present means transmitter transmit signals and then it will hit uh, hit into obstacle that obstacle reflect and then receiver capture capture that signal so here three pins plus minus center pin was output so this led showing ir sensor whenever it obstacle means it will glowing and then we are using buzzer LEDs and power resistor. So now we are going to see connection. So now we are going to see connections. So already we dump into Arduino, you know. So now we connect IR sensor. IR sensor. Okay, we will give plus 5 volt and ground pin to Arduino Uno. So this one is plus 5 volt. So plus 5 volt like. IR sensor plus 5 volt pin connected with plus 5 volt on Arduino Uno. And then ground pin connected with ground pin of Arduino Uno. Next, second pin was connected with Arduino Uno, like digital pin, IR sensor output was connected. Now your sensor was interfaced with Arduino you know. Next LED. So here we are using breadboard connection. After that, buzzer.
universe connected with third pin Next buzzer connected with fourth pin of ordinary phone. Next ground pin. So now all the connections was made. Like here since our output was connected with second pin of ordinary you know like those pins are this one is output pin of IR sensor given into ordinary you know this is LED this one is buzzer so now we check by give power supply to ordinary you know So no obstacle present message was displayed by LCD. So whenever obstacle present, warning obstacle there. LED was glowing. Okay. No warning obstacle there. So this system used to detect obstacle present of it or yeah, sensor like any human present or walking side in agriculture field home automation side we are using your sensor to detect obstacles so once again we check Okay, thank you.